All right, guys. Welcome back to my walkthrough of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. This is going to be the next part. Um, now, if you saw in the last part, I did the rest of Gary's side missions, which was um, poster session. Then I did a dirty dishes, told one of the Giovanni candidates secrets that will prevent others from joining in the club, and I ended up uh, getting the. Um, so cough kiss back to uh, the prince, but unfortunately we need some kind of device or key. I wouldn't recommend walking. Certainly Sebastian's already so, provided cab fare. I'm sure he always spares no expense when archaeology is at stake. A few questions. Excellent. The society, for the most part, knows very little about us. But they do know how to kill and torture us, and that's enough. Also, some of them exhibit powers that can make them quite formidable. Best not to announce yourself. You spoke of Jenna Gena before. Think this car is, well, is a part of it? If we open it up and the world ends, then yes. If we open it up and the world does not end, then no. I'd wager the latter. Have you learned anything else about Thin Buds? How any sane kindred could think these poor unfortunates are an immediate threat to us is absurd. Most were afraid, or at the very least uneasy, around me. Tragic. Their desperation could very well hold the spark of revolution, however. Tell me about yourself. Hmm. I've said quite a lot about myself already. I know even less about you than you do me. Why don't you tell me about yourself? Right? Um... Let's see. I appreciate your interest in me. I'm fascinated by you. Then I'll let you in on a little secret. Beckett may not be the name I was born with. Events always seem to unfold wherever I go, like Chicago a few years ago. Oh, it's a bother to explain. Either I'm pursuing fate, or it's got a bone to pick with me. Unless you've got further questions, I'd really like to get back to looking at the sarcophagus. Did I have another question? Excellent. Remember, Doc... Okay. I wouldn't recommend... X. Remember, Okay. Let's talk to the prince, I guess. Did you find a way to open this? I can't have my protege looking plebeian, can I? You'll find I can be very generous towards those who serve me well. I mentioned I had to sink through the sewers. Chinatown fight a smith. Point made. Which is. We didn't know about the Kuiji. Traditionally, the Kuei Jin has stayed in Asian territory, and the kindred Europe, and later North America. But recently, they invaded the West Coast, killing off a substantial number of Anarchs. They lack the organization of the Camarilla, and think nothing of breaking the masquerade. Though we share similar traits, okay. there is oh. no fraternity between us. We embrace. They rise from the grave. They do not know the pleasure of blood. They are without clan. No, oh, yes. They believe our kind to be inferior. They are as much of a threat as the wolves. Wolves? Werewolves. I can still recall a time when cities were surrounded by miles of forests full of the beasts. But progress has taken care of that problem. Another question. Which is... What do you think is inside if the... If you couldn't take the time to ask, perhaps we'd know by now. As I mentioned before, my concern is that it pertains something supernatural. Now, Beckett has waved this theory altogether. The city is alight with dread. Perhaps it's an antediluvian. A joke. The antediluvians are the mythical progenitors of each of the clans for whom they trace their bloodlines. And according to mythology, descendants of Cain, the legendary first vampire. Cain? As in the biblical Cain and Abel? Before you put too much stock in it... Realize that the church and all of its mythos are blends of kindred and mortal meddling. Whips to regulate weak minds. 
This is all Beckett's field of expertise. If you want a lesson, merely ask him. Which is... Never mind, bitch! I wouldn't recommend... Excellent. Remember... Okay, so let's go. Jeez! LaCroix, you're so fucking power hungry, I can't! Uh, I think Sebastian is one of the people I do not like. Well, yeah. of course he's the main antagonist. Like, he's so power hungry to get the sarcophagus open to have all that power. Alright, so... We have both items for Pisha. We should go visit her again. So let's go visit her, guys. But yeah, uh, I think I'm almost done with this. This probably might be the last part. I'm not even sure. Maybe the next part is going to be the last. Um... But yeah. Right? Yo, what's up, bitch? Yes. Here's the here's the item for the museum. Yes. This is genuine and of use to me. Her eyes there are so freaking scary. From it. A whisper. I will give you this in trade. It is known as the odious chalice. It swells with spilled blood and offers its bloat to its owner. And you? Uh, thanks. Another question. Yes. It's a book you were looking for. The Voce del Morte. The Giovanni never willingly share their secrets, and I've had little success infiltrating their strongholds. How did you obtain this? Never mind, just give me what you promised. It will take some time to translate and unlock the secrets of this. I will have to move on from this city to evade any Giovanni seeking it. Take this. This will complete the terms we agreed to, and I think it is adequate compensation. It is the key of Alamut. It instills dread in those that would harm you, and makes it harder for them to strike you. Make no mistake, our dealings do not make us allies. If indeed we meet again, do not ask me for any favors. I will give you this final advice, however. Leave this city. These are its final nights. Discord looms heavy. I've felt this before. Okay, what do you mean? In November of 1938, I was translating documents in Leipzig, Germany, written by a purported Crusades-era necromancer. There also, I felt a sense of impending chaos. Soon after was the Kristallnacht, the wellspring of a new world war. Oh boy. See, think I'll take that in consideration. Okay, so we finished our cultish person, you bought preserve, and we just ease your items in return. So the only one we have in society is to preserve. So that's the only one we have. Um. What? Oh. I guess I can't read this because I think I'm already maxed out. Dodge ability of at least four. Melee and dodge. Let me just see. Uh, I guess I maxed out, I guess. Alright. Okay, let's get out of here and uh, get a blood doll, I guess. Right. Right, let's get out of here, go to our haven. Oh boy, um, let's see.
Not this way. Alright. Um... Oh, fudge. Went the wrong way. Damn it. Alright, but yeah, I think I'm almost done. Uh, this may not be the last part. Um, I'm not even sure. We go. Money been a while. Your money. Him, bro. Okay. Thanks, bruh. All right. I beg your pardon. All right. All right. Okay. Ah, uh, let's see. I don't even know what to freaking do. Damn it, I messed up, okay. Damn it, okay. Master? We go. All right, let's see. Um, That should be it. Um, let me check my emails. All right. All right. Curio.
Alright, uh, yeah, so this may not be my last episode. Maybe, because, um... I still have a lot of things to do. Alright. I want you to find President Smith. Okay. Up. Oh. All right. But yeah. Uh, after playing Vampire the Masquerade, I was gonna do uh, Monster Madness, but I don't know. Like, I might focus on some games that I have on my computer, like Penumbra. Um, I ha I was gonna have my sister play it, but, uh, uh, being that she doesn't want to play the game, but, you know, I might play the game, because I saw my market player play the game, um, so I might play the game. Let's go to Santa Monica. Alright. Oh! Kuyo! Where are you? Right. We got. I got seventeen. Took a trip to see a friend of mine. He's a quartermaster down at a police station in OC. Guy's been miffed about a pay freeze, so he's agreed to start filling my wish list for a cut. Got a SWAT rifle out of this trip. Interested? Oh yeah, and then some. Ooh. Hmm, interesting. Oh, well, let's see. Hmm. Is this a pistol? Hmm. These are good guns to get, y'all. Um, I'm just gonna get the flamethrower. Oh, do I have enough? Okay. Ammo full? Okay. Move full, okay. Okay. Um. Go. Um. Go. All right, woo! I got ammo on the head. All right, pretty freaking good, guys. Now let's go to the club and uh.
Right at, okay, so I gotta return to Heather, Heather right after, okay. Alright. But yeah, uh, like I said, y'all, I don't know what I'm gonna do after this. I might play PC games that I have and already played. I missed you. All right, there we go. Let's see if I can try to go see if I can see Tourette. I believe her name is. And of course, the music is not mine. It's the creators of the game. Good evening. Hello, sweetheart. How are you two getting along? We're bridging valleys. But I still can't persuade her to wear eyeshadow. And you won't. What's going on in Santa Monica? I did get word from the prince. Oh, let me tell her. Be my guest. Therese has officially sided with the Camarilla. Could be a prince one day. Graduations. Good evening. Hello, sweetheart. Right. Okay, so she seems to be doing um pretty good. <laughs> so uh multiple personality? Scary. Love this music. Yeah, let's freaking go. And let's go to let's go to Hollywood real quick. Need a ride? Talk to Vivi. Let's see if Vivi has anything. Or Velvet, whatever you want to say her name. Geez, only twenty three minutes went by. Wow. Yo, what's up, bitches? Talk to Velvet. Oh. Vivi? Did she run away? Hi there. What? Listen, I don't have to take this. <sighs> I wonder when Matchit's gonna come in here tonight. <laughs> oh? So she's dancing up on the bar. Go, bitch! Go, Vivi. What's up, oh, Velvet? Go, bitch! Dance! No, just kidding. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, y'all. I'm kidding. I'm just- it's a joke! Alright. Well, I guess let's go do the main mission, I guess. Um, what is it? Becca wants you to find Professor Johansson, who is being held by the Society of Leopold. You need to find a way to get inside and locate him. Okay, and I do need to talk to Heather, but... Um... It's basically after the main mission. Alright. Just trying to see... Because there is a side thing. But yes, like, oh, uh, but yeah, I've been playing on the plus patch mode. Let's go to Society of Leopold. Right? Alright, let me save here.
Greetings, Commander. Greetings, soldier. Shh. Anything to report? The Gladius Day has told us to keep a sharp eye. He thinks we may have some visitors visitors this evening. Oh course, shit. Sir. My duty as always is to protect the Brotherhood. All seems quiet for now. Good, good. Did he mention uh, what kind of visitor, sir? The only kind that matters, soldier. Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Carry on. Uh, I might have to go loud with this one. Well, I might need my guns for this. I guess I have no choice. Oh. I need blood. <laughs> Alright, give me your blood. Bitch. There we go. All right. Shit, this hill. Uh. 
go. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, they said to the back door? Okay. Okay, game? Do not piss me off. To the back door. Okay. Game. Okay. Oof. I pray now that you give me strength in battle, that I might overcome the hordes of Satan and his children, that I might wield the flaming sword of the archangel and defend myself with your shield of faith. That my victories are many and my wounds few, that I might further your kingdom. And if I meet death tonight, then let it be first that I cast a mighty host of demons back into the lake of fire once they came, and then rest finally in the light of the Amen. There we go. He's right near me. Go. Go. Oh, I killed him. Right. Right. Go. We go. Journal. Right. All right. Where's the journal? Alright, if you want to read this journal, you can pause the video. GB.
Jesus is long. Um. Right. I'm reading this in my head, that's why I'm not reading it out loud. Right? And in one paragraph at a time. Oh boy. Jesus. Blood heal. Actually, all right. Blood heal. Right? Oh. Okay. Give me your blood, peasant! Alright, there we go. Alright, uh, let's check this room out. Let's see. Alright. Alright, if you want to read this, you can pause the video. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm going through this. Right? Alright, we got a key.
Okay. Well, at least for a while, I can't- well... I guess I'll take that. I'll take it, but... Alright. No, this is the outside. Nope. Which locked door? I'm gonna stay right here just in case. Alright, so... Let's do this password right here. Alright. Here we go. go right give me your blood peasant thank you all right All right, let's go down, see where this leads us. Now, I died before, because I didn't know what I was doing. So, I think I'm going to save up to every, like... Go. Go. Huh? 
Alright. Some blood heal. Oh, fudge. Where the f No. Thank you. Right. Um Oh hello. Fire. I can still feel it in my wounds. They'll kill me. They'll come back with their brands and it will burn. Keep your voice down. I wouldn't talk so they burn me. Again. And again and again. Their eyes, they, they enjoyed it. Before they come back, I'm begging you. Let me out. I look for a way out. They always come back. And it always burns. Okay, anyway, I'll be back. All right? Spanish Captain Sixty, why don't you help once more? Damn it, okay. Here we go. Thanks. You'll never see me again. I'm gonna go somewhere no one will ever see this face again. Alright, goodbye, Ash. Alright. Rescue. go and he runs all right actually let me go back Let me save right here. But oh wait. Okay. All Right. 
Oh fuck. Here we go. Drink your blood, sir. Thank you. No. Unfortunately, all right. Unfortunately, I have to end here, y'all. Um, I will want to play more, but like I said, this is not the last part. Um, I might have two more parts, maybe one more part after this. I'm not sure. Uh, but uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned for the next part of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. If you like this part, please leave a like, comment below on how I did with this series, and subscribe to my channel to stay tuned to all my amazing gaming content. This has been Leah Type Gaming. Peace out.